Hi, I'm Rick Dior, and welcome to my NARD playthrough. And today we're going to be playing page 26. So one of the things I love about the NARD book is there's so many different styles of rudimental drumming represented because you have so many different authors. And sometimes you get some really quirky solos, really interesting. And this is one of them. This is called The Rhythm Quick Step in 6-8 by H.R. Todd. And this is uh, kind of a strange solo. There's lots and lots of dynamics written in, not always practical, but certainly challenging. So you have to try to, you know, bring those out as best you can. And to do that, it takes a lot of intensity. So you have to use some different kinds of strokes. So you see here at the end with these um, triplet or three note, eighth note groupings, I'm using a lot of wrist to play these fortissimo. He also has lots of sevens written in and they're dotted. So one, two, and three. One, two, three, four. So you gotta do that pickup, all right? And those will be dotted. That's how you know which ones those are. They're dotted eighths. So I'll show you one here on the screen. So this is definitely a solo worth uh, working on. And if you have students, definitely work on it with your students. Also, it's good to do it slower and we'll do that for you now. I'll do it at dotted quarter equals 96. One, two, one, two. Even trickier at that tempo, I think, anyway. Uh, one thing I should mention that on these particular dotted quarter note rolls that happen in line uh, four, I'm sticking them like this. So right, left, right, left. And I'm pulsing that, okay, with the music. So. Um, it'd be 30 second notes, all right? Actually, 64th notes, if you're thinking those as 16ths, all right? So it's double that, just a roll, remember, but open. Okay, and finally on this page, we have the second one, drum solo. We'll do this at 120. One, two, one, two. All right, so that's uh, that's a good one. It's hard that fast, but uh, you don't have to play it that fast, but you see how I'm doing those crescendos. Now that little four stroke rough, that's the first time we've seen that in the book so far. That's in the last two bars. So I'm doing it as written. You're gonna lead with the left, so you're gonna need to practice that over and over. All right, we'll do the slow for you at quarter note equals 100. One, two, one, two.
Now, uh, one more thing I forgot to mention, and this is kind of important and also mystifying. So it has first time mezzo forte, second time fortissimo, which is fine. First ending, he's got this forte piano, which is kind of strange if you're going back and doing it fortissimo the second time. So I just take that as being the roll uh, soft and that note where the FP is on to be accented. So it's kind of a strange thing. It's hard to interpret that. So that's what I do there. So I hope you enjoyed this page 26 and we'll be back soon with page 27.